Welcome. This is Neo-Human Eve. In the words of Aristotle, it is the mark of an educated mind to be able to entertain a thought without accepting it. The truest sign of intelligence is the ability to entertain two contradictory ideas simultaneously. In other words, one of the truest marks of intelligence is being able to consider opposite ideas without immediately accepting or rejecting one of them. Every issue has at least two sides or more. And if we only research or think about one side of an issue and reject the other side without consideration, that is the highest form of willful ignorance. This is the main dividing factor between the two types of people you come across when discussing the globe earth deception or other factions of the matrix. In school, as children, we're presented with the globe model and told it is absolutely true and correct and proven beyond any shadow of a doubt. The majority of students never consider another side to this story because they've been told there isn't any. But in reality, there are other models of the Earth. The globe is not the only possible shape of the Earth that people have believed in or found evidence for. For thousands of years, people had plenty of evidence for a level plain Earth. So there are two sides to this story. The truly intelligent person, the true detective, the one who is going to get to the truth must examine all sides of the story, must look at all evidence and do so with an open mind. Skeptical, critically thinking, not with a foregone conclusion, full of ego. No, you have to actually do your due diligence and research it. Condemnation without investigation is the height of ignorance. Nothing is more challenging than the ability to study, discuss, and think through a concept without immediately accepting or rejecting it. So, if it's the mark of true intelligence to be able to hold opposite ideas simultaneously without deciding, it must be the mark of true ignorance to mock those who give evidence for the other side of the argument. Not everyone is ready to be unplugged from the globe earth deception. Those who in the spirit of Aristotle, can entertain two contradictory ideas long enough to delve into level earth research, will unveil the truth from deception and break free from the globe earth matrix, a prison for the mind.